Thank you, Shannon, for supplying today's beer for beer time. Today we have the Birthday Bomb from Prairie Artisan Ales. Birthday Bomb, Imperial Stout, aged on coffee, cocoa nibs, vanilla beans, and chili peppers, coming in at a strong 13% ABV. So thanks again, Shannon. We are definitely going to enjoy this one. Welcome back to beer time. That's warm. That's really warm. Um, as we haven't discussed yet, this is actually three years old as of this month, which I can taste quite a bit that happening. It is definitely aged in a beautiful way. Uh, it smells ridiculous. It is almost black. That is just a straight black beverage, just making it that much more amazing. You definitely get a little bit of the vanilla, a lot of the coca nibs. The coffee is there, but subtle. Not like most coffee stouts. I think it's a little less on the coffee, which is pretty cool. It's not as overpowering as most. And there's definitely a bit of it was just chilies, right? Yeah, and chili peppers. It has like a little bit of that warmth in the back of your throat. Like the Atomic Pumpkin had that we just did recently from uh, New Belgium. The Voodoo Atomic Pumpkin. Uh, a hair of that. Nowhere close to that Atomic Pumpkin level, but it is there. And, oh boy. This, this is a big boy stout. It really is. Uh, it tastes kind of boozy. And by kind of, I mean it's really boozy. Um, it, it, we were talking earlier, it's 13% out of the bat, but it's three years old, so I'd say it's probably closer to 15 now, if I had to guess. 14 and a half, maybe. Which seems to be a really, really good point for very strong, wonderful stouts. Every time I have like a 14-something percent stout, it's always perfect. Ooh-wee. Well, this is, this is a great first uh, notch in the belt from Prairie, what, Prairie Brewing. Perry RT... Teas and Ales. I keep getting sillier with these names. First beer I've had from them. I believe they still make it occasionally. I think it's out there from what I was reading. Uh, so you could be able to get a hold of it. I'd say it's definitely a must buy. If you like really robust, nasty, in a good way, stouts. Because this is exceptional. It's quite a bit different. It's not as creamy or smooth or chocolatey as most um which i think that's the point of the chili peppers being in this one right yep must buy go get you one go age one too if you can and catch you later <laughs>